Welcome to my first episode of my Madden Draft Champions and check out this sick run by Lamar Miller and yes I know I skipped the draft and you will see why in about 15 seconds or so from now. It was a very close game I scored a touchdown but then he threw a nice little fade route to tie the game up but I got to the red zone we just this game went back and forth just kept scoring Dwayne Bow with the touchdown fourth down after a bunch of goal line stops he made the touchdown but right here you're about to find out why I didn't show the draft because my Xbox froze on my first ever draft champions ever how does that happen on my first draft champions time to draft a new team so we're about to get back into this again. Okay, thank you for my little pack. I'd rather take a win. You finished this. You finished this season with a zero and one record. Well, let's get to the second draft. Hopefully, we're gonna go with Sean Payton, the coach, New Orleans. This is a good first round. So we got Cam Newton, Carlos Dansby, and Alshon Jeffrey. That's a hard pick, but we gotta go with the middle linebacker. What can I say? We're gonna go with Carlos Dansby. Second round, we got Darian Stewart, Kareem Jackson, Jerry Hughes. Got to go with the cornerback. T.Y. Right. No Hilton, Julius Thomas, Ryan Tannehill. Got to go with my boy T.Y. What can I say? Talent. We need and wideouts. Last, my, my last one, I had Dwayne Bow as my number one receiver. Puzlinski, Tim Jennings, or Reggie Nelson. Um, That's a hard choice. We're going to go with Tim Jennings this time, though. Because um, I may blitz more often and I want good corners. Oh! Antoine Bethea, Tashawn Gibson, or Mario Williams. Strong safety or left end? I'm sorry, Antoine Bethea, but gotta start from the lineup. Gotta start from the front. We're going with Mario Williams. Oh my! I'm getting a ridiculous. This is the, a much better draft than last time. Arian Foster, AJ Green, Dante Hightower. Um, that's a hard one. AJ Green or Arian Foster or Dante Hightower? Arian Foster. Geno Atkins, Lance Briggs, or a cornerback? Um, I feel like I'm going to run out of the nickel more. In other words, I will not use a defensive tackle as much. So we're going to go with another cornerback. Doomerville, Ninkovich, or Dewan Landry? Doomerville. That's an easy choice. Round nine, Delaney Walker, Steven Jackson, Reuben Randall. Don't have a tight end? Going with Delaney Walker. Ten, Antonio Gates! Ah! No, why would you do this to me? I'm sorry, Antonio Gates, I'm sorry. But I have Delaney Walker and I don't have a, I don't ha I didn't draft anyone on the line. So we gotta go with Ryan K No, no, I don't care. We're gonna take you. We already have a tight end, but we're going with my boy Antonio Gates. I'm a loyal fan and I love the man. That rhymed. So gotta go with my boy. Alright. Zach Ertz, Michael Crabtree. We got some receivers though. He's gonna thrive in the system. They plan Andrew on Luck, Yonda, or left tackle. Oh. Andrew Luck! I have some pretty good corners, so we're gonna go with Vontez Perfect. Shoot, this is a hard choice. Well, we don't have a safety period, so we might as well get pick up a safety. And for the final pick, my boy LaDainian Thompson! Let's go! Derek Brooks and Ray Lewis. This is like, this is the best draft. Well, I can't say the best draft because I've only done two drafts, but this is so much better than last than the last draft, but it's so good, it's screwing me up. Like, I already have Arian Foster. I could really use Derek Brooks or Ray Lewis, but what can I say? I'm sorry, Arian Foster. We're going with LaDainian Tomlinson. I know you guys are probably saying, K, you're being stupid. Well, I may be being stupid, but I'm a Chargers fan. I, I need to get Ladanian Thompson. So we're running with two, with two ridiculous yeah, running backs. Let's get it. Now let's see what this team can do. I'm excited. Now we're about to do a little roster recap. We got Andrew Luck, Ladanian Thompson, Arian Foster behind him. We have T.Y. Hilton, Michael Crabtree, 
and Antonio Gates and Delaney Walker at fullback. That's a pretty solid offense, and defense is impressive as well. We got Mario Williams, Carlos Dansby, Vontez Perfect, Elvis Dumerville. We have Leon Hall. Um, look at the cornerbacks. The corners are good, and we have a good, strong safety with Patrick Chung. But the offense and defensive line are slacking, and here's a little size up for my next opponent that I'm taking on to redeem myself from my last draft champions where the game froze and I'm receiving the kick and let's see what we can do receiving the ball on the four yard line all right good blocks to the outside and I get up to about the 26 yard line for a decent return and I am excited why because Ladanian Tomlinson if you guys don't already know I'm pretty sure you do but he is my favorite player ever. He was my idol growing up, and he's showing why. He's breaking tackles and fighting for extra yards, making it to the 50-yard line. First and 10, dropping back with Andrew Luck. And I see you, Crabtree, on the curl route, picking up the first down. I'm getting a good drive going. Halfback toss to Arian Foster. And he gets a very impressive pickup as well. This dual threat backfield will be dangerous. Third and goal after two run stuffs, and third time's the charm. As I go with the run up the middle, Ladanian Thompson scoring the touchdown. First and 10 for my opponent. He goes with the play action, but the pressure. Mario Williams gets the sack. Second and 25. He hands off to Ladanian Thompson. He gets decent blocking. I have two missed tackles. And then he breaks two tackles himself. And we finally tackle him after he gains a 22 yard run. Third and three. Play action. Scrambles out, and he throws it to the tight end that picks up the first down. All right. Come on, squad. What can we do? Drop him back. He's thrown across the middle, but he throws it right to my middle linebacker who makes the pick, showing why the generated base team players matter too. But believe me, I'm not saying the players you draft are not important because they are. T.Y. Hilton, show them them burners. The elite player I drafted gets the deep ball reception. Get me back in the red zone on the six yard line with a minute and 25 seconds left. No one's open. I decide to make the smart pass to Antonio Gates who gets hit in the kneecaps, but that kind of flips him forward to the two yard line, third and goal. Go with the halfback toss to LaDainian Thompson. Great two blocks on the outside and that is another touchdown for the all time great. After a six yard run, it's second and four and he has 44 seconds to score. But the pressure is too much as Mario Williams gets his second sack. And before the half, he decides to take one Hail Mary throw to the end zone, but it does not make it there. Second and three, when my opponent received a half, he throws it to the corner route, to his receiver, and picks up a first down. My opponent is starting to drive. Three-step drop, drops back a little bit more, but that was a bad idea considering he backed up right into Elvis Dumerville getting me the sack. Third and 14, going with the play action. Getting some pressure with Vontez Perfect. Scrambles out, but completes the pass to 89, who gives a monster stiff arm and gets the ball up to the 34-yard line. Second and eight. Goes with the play action once again, and we get the pressure, forcing the incompletion. Now it's third and eight. He's looking for an open man. Throws it, and that is incomplete, so he will have to go for the field goal. Honestly, if I were him, I would have gone for it. I mean, he was on the 18-yard line, down by 14. But, hey, that gives me the ball back, up by 11. I go to play action myself, but I get sacked. Andrew Luck takes a hit. Third and 13 after passing completion. But we're going to hit Mr. Reliable. Antonio Gates jumps up, catches the ball in traffic, getting me the first down. But I think it's time to get Antonio Gates some highlights. So we're going to seam pass. I chuck it up, and... He catches it and trucks two players and throws them to the ground. And he will not be caught as he leaps into the end zone. That was beautiful. That was as embarrassing as the Jared Haynes truck on the Chargers during the preseason week four game. My opponent then hits Odo Beckham Jr. on a post route, getting the first down. 21 to 3. And once again, the pressure. Mario Williams gets his third sack of the game. That brings it to third and 17 with a minute and 40 seconds left to go. Once again, he completes a third and long with Mark Sanchez. I don't know how. Getting some pressure. Mark Sanchez gets hit, but the receiver makes a great reception. He is now on the one yard line. Hand off to LT and he waltzes into the end zone. So it's now 21 to 10. I decided to do a little halfback toss to LT. That was almost a touchdown. Second and two. We're going all out with 20 seconds left. Why run the ball? 
that's it. Play action, and Andrew Luck gets hit from his blind side. That is third and long. And after an incompletion, it's fourth and 11. We decide to have some fun with five seconds left and go with the fake punt. Oh, God. I'm just scared. A was wide open, but I don't know why. I just threw it to Y. But regardless, that was the last play of the game. So we win 21 to 10 in my first episode of Draft Champions. Check out these stats. Andrew Luck, 146 quarterback rating, 205 yards, one touchdown, no picks. LT had, dang, his LT cooked. Mine averaged 3.6 yards a carry, but had two touchdowns. I may have not had a lot of rushing yards, but LT had 36 receiving yards, Antonio Gates had 78, and T.Y. Hilton with that 71-yard bomb. And of course, Mario William, three sacks, Doomerville had one as well, and my middle linebacker, Will Cotter, Will Hoot, whatever his name is, had the pick. So far, my draft champions team is looking pretty solid. Long term wise, I probably could have made better decisions, but I couldn't give up, I couldn't pass on my man LaDainian Thompson and Antonio Gates. Hopefully it doesn't come back to bite me, but Game Changer Packs just came out. Yes, I know this isn't much, but you know, they're, they're fresh, they're new, so might as well um, open them on this video, because my next mutt probably won't come out in a few days, but let's see what we get. I mean, do I not get Did my Xbox just freeze? Nice. So apparently I already opened up a pack. So this pack consists of, let's see, these guys. <laughs> Mike Wallace, blah, blah, blah. So, you know, no one really that great. So, and um, the pack, and now I have zero unopened packs. Okay, thank God now they're here. But let's see who we get in these packs. All right, Legends Topper. Okay, Legends Badge. All right, now to the true first pack. Gold Badge, Chance Warmick, or Warmack, Ladrian, La Adrian Battle, Steelers Jersey, Randy Gregory, um, the Schefter Star. Okay, Eric Fisher. Can I get like a big name? That'd be real awesome. Do it for the subscribers. We did get a good left tackle out of it though, and we got the Randy Gregory. But hopefully we can get something better than these guys, you know? Andrew Corliss. John Brown. Who is that? David Stewart. Jared. Emmanuel Sanders. Good pickup. Vance McDonald, my man from my fantasy uh, fantasy franchise. All right, I think I have like one or two more. All right, I have two more. Parrish Cox, Tom Coughlin. Got another Randy Gregory, so we can complete. You know, we can make the old. We can make the elite version. Oh, oh, holy badge. It just turned red. I thought it was going to be someone dirty. But I'll take that too, you know. They'll be useful down the road. All right. That, oh, and my man's Jason Brett, 79 overall. Never going to use him, but still. And for the last pack, let's see who we get. No one, no one. Center, Louis Delmas. Gold badge, Logan Ryan. Charles Woodson. Alan Ball. And Gary Kubiak. All right, this is truly the last pack. 85 overall, Brandon Flowers. I will take that. And also a Nate Allen strong safety, 84 overall football outsiders card. But I'm, I'll take that. Why couldn't I have just gotten him in the bundle so I didn't have to, you know, use another thousand points? Because you know I'm not rich. Brent Grimes, 84. I got another Randy Gregory, so I got four of them joints. And another Randy Gregory. I have five of them. <laughs> I could build a team of all Randy Gregories. And a Brandon Scherf, or Sheriff. But thank you so much for watching this Draft Champions, and stay tuned for the next episode to see if I can continue on to my road to the Draft Champions Super Bowl. I'm out.